12 News loves putting Southeast Texas first, and we were there today as a World War II veteran was honored with new medals. Sam Davis earned these medals after fighting in World War II, but they were lost years ago. You may remember Mr. Davis. We profiled him when he turned 100 back in May. Well, today, Congressman Brian Babin presented the retired Army Corporal with the new hardware. Our Kyle Orr was there, and Kyle, what a day for him. That's right, Jordan. Davis tells me he could not be happier to be surrounded by his family as he was honored for serving his country. Congressman Babin stopped by Davis's home in Beaumont earlier this afternoon. He was able to sit face to face with Davis, getting to know the 100 year old. Babin was there to present the Army Air Corps veteran with a certificate of special congressional recognition, along with a special capital flown American flag, a challenge coin, and of course, four shiny new service medals. Babin says he was honored to have the opportunity to recognize a hero. It means the world to me. A member of that greatest generation that came up during hard times and fought the Imperial Japanese and the Nazi Germans and, and prevailed and gave us the country that we have today. Davis says he was overwhelmed with emotion after receiving the medals, and he says the time he spent in the military instilled core values that never faded. I did everything in the world that the Army told me to do. I never questioned them, and whatever they said, they were boss. And that's been my life all the way through up until now. I've done what I was supposed to do. Davis earned the Good Conduct Medal, the Asiatic Pacific Campaign Medal, the American Campaign Medal, and the World War II Victory Medal. Now, Davis's B-29 Super Fortress was part of the 62nd Squadron that flew missions out of the northwest field of Guam in 1944 excuse me, against Imperial Japan. So, big congrats to him on his new medals. Live in studio, Kyle Orr, 12 News.